Jeff, you know you're not supposed to take any of this women home with you, right? I'm gonna try not to. Okay. It shouldn't be a try thing, but okay. Okay, I'm not going to. I still don't believe it. What's up guys, I'm Hunter March, and this is my father, Jeffrey, who you may have seen in a bunch of viral TikToks. Hello, nice to see you. And I've been single for a long time. People online thought my dad was uh, a catch, so maybe he can help me find a catch today. He's gonna be picking between eight different women for me to date. We're gonna see if his taste aligns with mine. I like it, it'll be interesting. It'll be, be, be interesting. The guy had a couple <laughs> shots before we got going. I'm not even kidding you. With one of the girls from the last video we just shot. So if you wanna see that video, go to my buddy David's video. David, come in here. If you want to see that video where he legitimately like is gonna go home, I think with yeah. one of the women from the last video. He totally ruined my shoot, but ruined in the best way possible. <laughs> yeah. So at the end of this video, there will be a link in the info section below. Check that out. But first, let's see if my dad can find me love. All right, you guys ready to see these two studs? Yeah. yeah. One, two, three. Oh, yeah. okay. <laughs> All right. So the son, the dad, dad and then here. the daddy. Cousin? Dad. So my dad, uh, he's been my dad ever since I was a kid. He, oh, wow. That's <laughs> crazy. Yeah. And we have decided that I've been single long enough. I want to solve that. And David recommended that my dad pick my ideal type person for life. So whoever, whichever one of you wins. Wow. What a commitment. <laughs> whichever one of you wins, we are locked in forever. So keep that in Great. mind. It's a tall order. <laughs> <laughs> all right, first off, we're gonna have Jeff swipe right or left on all you guys. Oh, this is fun. Oh, boy. <laughs> yeah, where are the roses? Right. Absolutely right. <laughs> Hi, I'm small. But... And cute. Aww. That's right. You're right. Hello. I'm British. Great voice, right? British. Are you really British? Yeah. British. Did you say yeah? Great smile. You're right. Oh okay. Gosh. Very right. Don't let me be the left one. You're right. That leaves me. And you know what I'm going to say. Right. To the right. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God, that would have been so awkward. I know, right? Just real quick, Hunter, would you have swipe left on any of these women? Just... All stunning. How could I swipe no? British accent on one, and then good old America for the rest of them. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want to know? Actually, what is the most embarrassing story you can tell us of Hunter? That's how we're starting I want it this? to be on the internet like for the world to know. You getting beat up on the playground that one time, that's a little embarrassing. <laughs> As a dad. <laughs> that's, that's sad. I got hit by a basketball. Oh, no. <laughs> a couple times. <laughs> it's a reoccurring thing. Yeah. Yeah. Basketball came back with a fucking left hook. What was I supposed to do? How would you describe Hunter in three words or a quick phrase? Very outgoing. That sounds slutty. You know he's slutty. How I can tell he's slutty. Girls no, I'm, sl I'm okay. slutty. He's, oh. he's a good boy. <laughs> How would you say he is in bed? <laughs> what a transition. <laughs> He's my son. Uh -huh. I'm gonna say probably pretty good. Okay. <laughs> and on a scale from one to 10, would you say like, or? We're going length or yeah, thickness? I'm <laughs> gonna put some music on. Would you like slow dance, put some, like what would you be dancing to in the kitchen with? I would say it's similar to the white claw in your hand. So what is, what do you Mango mean? Mango flavor. Just... Oh, sorry, I was answering the last question. <laughs> <laughs> So why should we date Hunter? It's a good question. He's smart, sweet. Okay. He's a good guy. He's, he's the kind of guy you could bring home to your mom. Mm -hmm. Or I'm not. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, well, Jeff, now I'm gonna have the girls walk out and then um, you and I are gonna discuss who you're gonna have to vote out. Oh, that's tough. I know. All right, guys, uh, we'll have you guys walk out and we're gonna discuss with his pop-up. All right, guys, so after uh, a bunch of, you know, deliberating, 
Jeff doesn't want to be the one to let you guys go. He thinks you guys are all perfect, but the first person he will be eliminating, once again, not me, him. Not me. Not him. me, <laughs> it was a joint effort. No. <laughs> and he said that this girl had a very great personality. It's just compatibility with what? I can't say that word. You suck at that word. Compatibility. Com compatibility. Whatever. <laughs> For some reason, he picked her. And it is Rudy. I knew it. It's it okay. Was, it was the fake Wait. British accent. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. I actually knew that I was going to be first, so. I'm no. psychic, basically. That confirmed my psychic abilities. Good luck. These girls are beautiful. Okay, bye, Rudy. Bye. Anyway, uh, second person who will be eliminated from Lovayland is Jane. <sighs> okay. You're great, though. Bye, you bye Jane. <laughs> you idiot. Those girls were great. I, I'm telling you, I feel two feet tall right now. It's killing me. And then the last girl, super sorry, but Paris. I'm so sorry. What's up with your taste, man? Jesus. I know. Sorry, Paris. I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> telling Jeff earlier secretly in the snack room that I love your guys's relationship so I just want to know like how you guys got so close I mean you had him it's very awesome. uh, similar personalities in a lot of ways I think okay I'm not your typical father figure I've been more of a friend all of their lives mom made us do homework that's what he's trying to say that's a nice balance it seems like Hunter is very stable at least just from first impressions yeah and he gets that from his mother <laughs> I mean, he's got a lot of both of our qualities. Sandy okay. is very driven and um, smart, goal-oriented. She's very smart. Well, I used to say he is Sandy, but with a... Giant dick. Well. <laughs> At least the size of a white claw. What is, like, the best place you've ever been to? What is, like, I want to go there more than anywhere in the world. This is my place, my favorite place ever. Honestly, probably my house. I like really? being home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like if uh, there's a lot of places to travel, and I've done a lot of traveling, and I like traveling, but it always feels really good to go home. So you spend a lot of time at home. What's yeah. something that really like when you're just really pressured? What clears your head the best? You're about five minutes on the couch with sweet Lucy. That's got it. <laughs> That's my always. dog. That's my dog. Yeah, she makes say, everyone feel say, better. Uh, you just say like me laying on a couch with a woman's well, name. Well, Lucy was dog, the, you know? the dog was coming up soon after, obviously. Yeah, I have four dogs. So. You have four dogs? I have four dogs, five cats. Do they all sleep in your room? Um, the cats, not really. They kind of just go around, but the dogs, yeah. On the bed? Um, sometimes. My dog slept on my bed every night of his entire life, I think. What kind of dog was it? He's a big pit bull. Big, sweet pit bull. That's what I have. Oh my goodness, and she's literally 13 right now. Mine died of cancer, cry? but it took, you know, he lived for 13, and that's a long time for a, a bully pit. I He's know. A Why are you boy. saying this to her? <laughs> just because we're talking animals. 13's yeah. young, you say that. It's just, <laughs> it's life. God damn it. I can't even remember how you broke Santa Claus to me not being real, but I gotta imagine it wasn't soft. At what age, though? Uh, he must 26. have been four or five. <laughs> How are you feeling? It's my birthday. It is? Yeah. Seriously? Mm -hmm. Happy birthday. Thank you. You can't eliminate her in the next round. I yeah. matter. You can say whatever the fuck you want now. You're safe for at least one more round. How old are you? Guess. Young. What's it, young? Guys don't guess women's age. They, don't, they don't guess if they're pregnant or not, and they don't guess ages. I'm going to say not pregnant. I'm going to go with that. <laughs> is there something he could do on the very first date where you would say, I'm gonna finish this meal, I'm gonna finish this drink, and that's the that. Oh, I hate when guys eat, like, pick off my food. Food Has off my Has that happened food. on a day before? That's happened to me before. I never knew it was like an ick of mine until recently, but this guy was like, I was done eating my food, and there was just nothing but sauce left. And he starts like dipping his fork in it and like licking it, and that was a huge ick. The scavenger. Me. Yeah, I was like, oh. You want this? So I want to start with asking your dad, and then I will move on to you. Oh, so there's, a, there's an itinerary. Yeah, um, I want to know. I was know... just going to say something really funny. I'm just glad I didn't. Go on. <laughs> I'm glad you didn't too. Can you imagine what it was? <laughs> We're glad. Yeah, everyone. you've been on the roll. Hey, you're learning, and I love it. <laughs> so um, what I want to know is, what are you most proud of that Hunter has accomplished? I am proud that he's got a good heart. And he's successful in his business, but he's a good person. I'm proud of that. 
for you, um, what do you think is the most important thing that your dad has taught you growing up? <laughs> if only you were there for some of these life lessons that I had to ignore. This is kind of an unconventional way to be on a first date. What yeah. would you describe a good first date to be? I want to go to dinner. I want to have a conversation. I want to go ahead and from there, if I like the person, definitely extend the date past the first dinner. Uh, like maybe go to the batting cages or something where we can like loosen up and fun. have fun. Uh, driving range, what? Nothing, I think that's a great idea. <laughs> What's your first date? A similar minus the batting cages. I love that. You know, a nice meal. Well, why not batting cages? Uh, you know, go to the batting cages, live it up. Well, go ahead, say what you were gonna say. <laughs> I wasn't gonna say anything. I just think you're on a date with a woman in heels and a nice skirt, you go batting cages, she's gonna look at you like, what? It's okay, I have sneakers in my car. Okay. I'm not I, athletic whatsoever, though, but I'll try. Neither is he, <laughs> so you're fine. I'm kidding. <laughs> Are you attracted to Hunter at all? Yeah. At all? Why did that yeah. at all? <laughs> wow. <laughs> I feel like for me, I'm not really into looks. It's more of the vibe. Like I said earlier, you could say one dumb thing and your looks kind of just go away for me. Great. So, but are the looks Do you think there, he's no? handsome yeah, as I think yes, he is? Yes, of course, of course. If you were to meet my father for the first time, like yeah. say we Always were in a relationship. Always back to dad. This is the fucking title of the video, man. Yeah. <laughs> well, he's like, why does this guy keep bringing me into these conversations? I just wanna hang out. Go uh, on. If you were to meet my father, like say we were uh, dating for a while and I wanted to introduce you. So I think I would feel right at home because you remind me a lot of my dad. Both of my parents are divorced as well. So I feel like growing up, I kind of saw the single side of my dad and he's kind of like big smile, kind of stud energy. So you kind of give me that. So I think I would feel right at home and I think it would be great. Does she win you over? Absolutely. <laughs> That's a good sign. Yeah, I, I, I think you'd be a lucky man. Yeah. Out of between the two of our dads, who do you think would win in a fight, fist fight? Oh, I don't know. Call your dad up. I'm a daddy's girl, so I gotta stick up for my dad. Okay, call your dad, tell him to get down here. All right, he'll fight. He will. He's five, down. Five, He's a tough dad, dude. He's so a right. tough. I think though, you're a big lover as well. You may seem tough, but at the end of the day, you're a lover, and Absolutely. I think my dad is the same as well. So, so I think you guys would. Up. Hugging. Fighting, My dad will be this close in your face saying, I love you, man. Yeah, so kissing. Think, yes, totally. <laughs> you guys just be grabbing each other. Oh, I love you. And you touch his butt. Nice ass. What's <laughs> up, dog? Okay. Well, thank you so much. This was a of lovely course, day. Of course, of course. All right, so Jeff, you just went on a few dates with these young ladies. Who are we liking, dude? What are we feeling? I like the last girl. You did. Bar none. And it's not because like you have like a really like you're not really good at keeping memory, just because she's the last girl, right? No, no. Well, no I, age wise, I, that would add up. I yeah, yeah. think I I liked uh, her personality. I thought she sounded intelligent and she could did. hold her own, which was really nice. Is there any other one? Yeah, who's it between? Um, the taller girl. What, what's yeah, her name? Bailey. Bailey. I like Bailey too. I think she's got a great personality. Yeah, she. Made I think she would hold her own with anybody, and I and I like that. Yeah, I yeah. feel like she was. She came in hot with her questions. She was like, "I got an itinerary." She's good. She's, she's ready to go. Very good. All Who the, did you uh, feel maybe was least compatible with Hunter? The second girl, I, I believe, that came out. Marilyn. 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 Why? Why do you think of that? Um, I just think when Hunter's not in front of a camera and he's being himself, it could be a little much for her. You're too much sometimes. <laughs> I hear it. Because right now he's being very proper and conservative because all the cameras, and we all know when there's no cameras, what he's really like, and it's a little different. Oh, I don't know if she can that handle in. that. Where <laughs> Bailey, I think would, you know, no sweat. And you're not, like, gonna ask any of these girls out for yourself after this, are you? I'm gonna be back in Costa Rica in two days. That leaves you one day. <laughs> All right, before Jeff chooses his perfect date for his son, yeah. does anybody want to self-eliminate? right now. Really the date was so bad <laughs> that you don't even want to risk it being you. <laughs> On the count of three, leave now. What, is, what do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? One, two, three. You're giving them a lot of chances and they haven't left yet. <laughs> yeah. I thought I'd let you yeah. fucking <laughs> why no, I know. It's, it's like, you know, when you always like, are you sure? Yeah. 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 you don't like yeah. him. Yeah. Are we Just sure? Are you sure? Does anyone want to look at him one more time? Jesus. <laughs> we like it. We like it. Do the dance again. Let's do the whole thing. Let's <laughs> Oh. Okay. okay, does anybody want to leave now? <laughs> All right, Jeff. Ready? 
Yeah. Um, it's going to be Brianna. Hey, Hi, how are you? I'm going to get a wine now. <laughs> yeah. It was very difficult. I just thought this would be a nice little couple. Well, thank you to everybody. Congrats to us on our brand new relationship. Before you guys click away, though, we did a video on David's channel where the girls pick me. And it was as cringy as it sounds. <laughs> they kind of tore me apart at times, and it was weird, but it's really, really funny. So go check it out. My dad ends up... I think sleeping with one of the girls from that video. <laughs> Legitimately, he left for a little while with her. Do not know what happened. Uh, so if you want to see that, click the video in the description to watch David's video. This was, uh, this was really nice. It really was. I appreciate your time. I appreciate your time, yeah. and I'm looking forward to the rest of our lives. It was totally. a lovely, lovely little day. Okay. I had a great time. All right. Thanks. Yeah.